Good evening. Welcome to Cafe Lena. Thank you for joining us tonight. Thank you for being here. This is the point where you guys clap. <laughs> so we we have a very small audience here tonight. Just just a small group of friends and family. Um, we but a quality audience. That's right. And but we are we are getting ready to uh, to welcome uh, a, a slightly larger group uh, from the community back next Friday the second. We're very excited about that. Um, this is a little bit of a dry run. Um, but really, the, the, the point, the focus uh, of all of our shows going forward is going to continue to be our live streams. Um, so all of you out there watching, you are just as incredibly important to us as you have been this past year. Um, so tonight we have Maria Gillard, the Maria Gillard Trio. Um, Maria has a new CD out, um, so you're going to hear some new music tonight. It's called Always Love, um, and you can find that on her website. I'll be putting that in the chat uh, a couple times throughout the night so you'll know where to go. Um, for, for all of you watching out there, uh, please join us in the chat. Say hello. Let us know where you're watching from. Uh, it's, it's, it's our way of kind of trying to... to recreate the Cafe Lena atmosphere. You can't really do that if you're not in the room, but it's it, you can still see people that you know. You can still uh, get an idea of you know how far and wide people are you know really watching this show. So um, say hello in the chat, and also make sure to visit the virtual tip jar. It's going to be on your screen in the in the lower left hand corner for you. I will send it in the chat a bunch of times. It's going to be in the description of the live streams. Um, it's cafelina.org slash tips. You can't miss it. And this whole year, this past year, it has been the main reason we've been able to continue having music and, and doing these live streams and continuing to pay all of our artists. So uh, if you are able to, please uh, give generously in the tip jar and have a wonderful night with the Maria Gillard Trio. so much, Riswell. It's a wonderful um, place here to be, and we're very happy to be here. So here's our first song. This is called I Wish I Could Find You. Take a left at the light and a right at the corner store. Go down that road seven miles. It was you and me, we sat on the porch, singing songs underneath the moon. Whippoorwill, calling all night long, catbird crying out a lonesome tune. You were there right by my side, where the red Just like the wind Left me with 
Um, uh oh, I turned off that. Turned it off. These lights are really like you're on the Ed Sullivan stage or something. Really big shoe. Well, here's a song for the springtime. I can't eat. I can't sleep. I'm floating on a cloud. It's pouring rain, thunder and lightning, and I'm laughing right out loud. I see you, feel you way above the crowd. Well, it must be I'm in love. Well, I can't think, I can't sit still, smiling and everything. time to fall in love, the birds and the bees and all that.
Yes, I saw some uh, outside the window of, of my office. There's like a, a some type of cherry tree, I think. And uh, all the, of course, all the leaves are gone right now. So I went out and bought a couple of those bird bells and some suet and um, another type of uh, all that those little finch bags. Oh, I and I'm that. really getting some really cool birds coming around That's saying hey. Great. Yeah. I love the finches. We have a lot of finches on our yard in our yard. Um, so anyway, this song is a song that came about from uh, I went to a writing workshop with a bunch of English teachers, which is always <laughs> scary. Uh, but there were a couple of music teachers in there too. And um, the facilitator of the workshop said, um, I want everybody to write on the top of the page, I prefer, and then write for 10 minutes straight without move, taking the pen off the paper. So we all did that, and she asked us if we would uh, like to read. So I read mine, and um, the, one of the music teachers said, oh, you, that's a song. You have to make that into a song. Mm -hmm. And I was like, eh, you know, I'm not sure about that. <laughs> But um, I tried to, I think, a couple days later, and it, it, it just wasn't happening, so I forgot about it. And then I actually, the way I tried was I put it on my phone when I was going for a walk. I tried to remember all the things that I preferred, which I would, didn't know. And uh, then later on, I found it. Really, it was about a year and a half later. I thought, eh, I'll try writing that. So here it is. I prefer day to night I prefer loose to tight I prefer wood to stone And sometimes to be alone I prefer horns to strings Thoughts to things Windows to walls and baseball I prefer morning to afternoon Red, ripe strawberries in June The sound of a lonesome loon On a hot summer night I prefer orange to brown Friends who won't let me down All the people in town Fighting the good fight I prefer fire to ice I prefer rolling the dice Nickels to dimes and lemons to limes I prefer hands to feet I prefer snow to sleet Heart to head and hope to dread I prefer steel guitars Riding in convertible cars Driving all night somewhere far Where we can't be seen I prefer sunny July Homemade blueberry pie Blinking fireflies through the back sun to rain humble to vain I prefer yes to no and light to shadow I prefer silence to noise corduroys curly to straight and always love not hate always love 
always in love Thank you. Well, we've named our CD Always Love after that song. Here it is. So, Maria Gelli Trio. By the way, this is Perry Cleveland that was just playing the fiddle. And, uh, and he plays a, an array of instruments. And this is Doug Henry on the upright bass. And um, so you can find this at mariagillard.com. There's a little um, icon you can click that puts you right into PayPal. Or you could go into PayPal yourself and just put maria at mariagillard.com and tell me how many you want and send me your address. And I'm going to send it out to you. Do you have any restrictions on how many you could buy at one time, Maria? Like no. no more than 20? No, I have a lot of boxes at home. I can, I can send as many as needed. In case you want to buy all, all your friends some. So this next song is um, a song by Doogie McLean. He's a Sc Scottish songwriter, world-renowned musician and singer and songwriter. He's really a fantastic uh, performer, if you ever get a chance to see him. Um, and uh, this song is called Ready for the Storm. It's an angry sea, but there is no doubt The lighthouse will keep shining out To warn the lonely sailor The lightning strikes and the wind cuts cold Through the sailor's stone, through the sailor's soul Till there's nothing left that he can hold Except the rolling ocean Confrontation seems to tell me what it really means to be this lonely sailor. But when you take me by your side, you love me warm, you love me, and I should have realized I had no reason to be frightened. And I
Doogie McLean. Check him out on YouTube. Uh, he's really something. He has a YouTube video of him singing that with um, a couple of musicians and uh, Kathy Matea, oh, yeah. which is just gorgeous. Wow. All these flute flutes in the background, and uh, it's beautiful. And I'm not one of those people who talks in tunes, <laughs> so. So talk amongst yourselves, please. Yes. Pick a topic. Chat away in the chat. This song is in tune. The others. Yeah, the others, it doesn't really matter. It's fine, this one. This one. At least just, one song we've yeah, tried to be in tune. All right, well, this song is about great loss. I've been awake for Thinking about you, where you've been, how you feel, or what you do. All the things I should have said, all the ways I could have read into your eyes, into your eyes. I keep the days we laughed until we cried Talked about everything we felt inside We took on the world we did Fearless as little kids And then the rain came falling clock stop ticking when will I give it a rest when will I accept you won't be back you won't be coming back well, I could write you a Send it in the mail But what good would that do? Tell you all about my life Wait for you to call Saw me there, 
sleep tonight and have that going on. People have accused me of that. Why would you write that song? And now I'm up in the night with that clock thing going. Oh my God. Sorry. I don't want to be alone, that's why. I don't want to be the only one up at 2 in the morning pacing the halls. Oh, let's see. Well, this is going to be now something completely different. Okay, so I think maybe probably because this is very different. Tuning wars. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to tune now, and unless you're done. I'm done. I'll no, stop. it's okay. It's okay. We won't fight. We would, we really don't <laughs> normally fight. We try to be peaceful people. I accidentally uh, moved my keys here, uh, tuning pegs. And I knew it was in tune because I matched it up to the position that the tuning pegs on the album are on that I was playing from. But then I accidentally hit it when I put the mandolin on. So it's, it's off now. You know, musicians have a lot of problems. People don't know it. They think, oh yeah, they're all set. They're, you know, oh my gosh, they're just great. We got problems. Struggle's real. <laughs> well, um, so we're going to rock and roll. Here we go. One, two, three, four. It used to be darker. It used to be dangerous. I used to despise you. Now we're just strangers, us I used to desire you I must have been delirious Cause you were so delinquent I must have been desperate But I have taken a sharp turn It's amazing, amazing what you learn
Mr. Perry Cleveland on that little baby thing. Uh, so um, uh, I have a girlfriend who um, I used to play with um, in Rochester, and so we'd get together and um, rehearse, you know, get together on a Friday afternoon and go through songs. And one day she was over at my house, and I had my guitar s sitting there, and she was on the couch talking about an experience she had at this bar that she went to see this band. She goes, you know, I love that band, and I know that uh, a friend of mine was going to go, and so I was going to meet him there and watch the band. And, um, you know, while I was there, he's like sort of like inching up on me, you know? <laughs> inching up and, oh, you know, you think I could go get you a beer? And she's like, I, I just wanted to say, you know, in case you didn't, haven't noticed, I'm not your girlfriend. Okay, you know, you know how some people, they think one thing and then others think another. And uh, if you're out with somebody who's platonic and they're blood out, but you get the message. And so anyway, I was sitting there and so I just started going like this. In case you haven't noticed, I'm not your girlfriend and I'm not in love with you. In case you haven't noticed, you're not the boss of me, so don't tell me what to do. In case you haven't noticed, it always seems to be about you. I know you think that this is a date. Well, I that I came is cause I like the band on stage so don't say I didn't warn you you act like we're a couple and I'm the one who adores you see that guy over there I like to dance with Now I wish I brought my own car 
Why you got to follow me? I ain't going that far. Read my lips, mister. This is not a date. Soon this night will be history, and I'll be the girl you love to hate. In case you girlfriend and I'm not in love with you in case you haven't noticed you're not the boss of me so don't tell me what to do in case you haven't noticed it always seems to be about you always seems to be about you always talking about yourself never asking me anything about myself in fact i think i know every person you've played music with in the past 10 years many times like uh, tom rush and john hammond even and maybe jeff Muldar and jonathan edwards uh, that would have been nice i'd like to play with jonathan edwards but i don't know maybe I think you might have even played at Cafe Lena. In fact, maybe, maybe when Dave Van Ronk was here. Oh wait, didn't you play here with Bob Dylan? In case you haven't noticed. Yeah. Oh, thank you very much. Here's another. Um, plug for the CD. Now, that song was written um, together with Rita Coulter, who, um, and it was very spontaneous. Rita Coulter, a great singer and songwriter from Rochester, and she was in the great famous band Colorblind James Experience, if anybody ever heard of them, and I know there's some people watching that are probably clapping. They were a really big band in Rochester in the 80s, and Rita was their um, woman singer. And um, that is on this CD, and she sings on the CD on that song with us. And um, really, this, just that song on the CD is worth buying it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. So, <laughs> all right, the rest of the songs, forget about it. Um, we are from the Finger Lakes, if, uh, if people who don't even know us and are watching this, we're from the Finger Lakes uh, area. Um, I lived in Rochester, Ferry also lived in Rochester for many years, and um, so I still feel like I'm a big part of the Rochester music community, which is a big community, which is what I meant. And um, they had, uh, somebody came up with this idea of having all of Rochester write the same song. So they had a bunch of songwriters uh, submit tapes, or tapes. Nobody <laughs> submits tapes, okay? S recordings of a song that they've written on a theme. And this next song was a, the theme of how did we get here? So um, every year they did that, and then they'd have a concert of some of the submissions, people who um, they chose to be in the concert. So um, I want to make sure this is in tune, but this is my song about how did you get, how did we get here? And, um, and I hope you like it. Okay. Uh, we were just climbing the apple tree, drawn with sticks in the sand. We were just jumping on the trampoline. Suddenly we're 17, watching Hank Aaron's home. Trying so hard to be brave now, How did we get here so quickly? Seems like yesterday We were running around our old hometown Dreaming our days away We were just singing in varsity choir 
studying Spanish and French Doing chemistry homework on the telephone And you were secretly in love with Johnny Bench The co-captains on the high school team Coach Kayla was our hero then You swam the relay, I had to dive Suddenly we're 35 Ooh, how did we get here so quickly? Seems like yesterday We were running around our old hometown Dreaming our days away sad that Hank Aaron died this year. This is called drop D tuning. Whenever we have this, we have to make sure it's in tune. Uh, so, um, tomorrow's Palm Sunday, yes. the beginning of Holy Week in the Christian and Catholic religion. And, um, you know, years ago, I remember being in a pharmacy, this is back in the 80s, and seeing all the Easter paraphernalia up, like, at the end of February, I was like, and Easter that year was later in April, you know how it sort of shifts around according to the full moon. And um, there were all those little yellow chicks and the, the little plastic baskets and everything, a big display. And I just thought, geez, I don't remember Easter being quite that commercialized. I mean, it's different at Christmas, but Easter, I didn't, didn't remember that. So it made me start thinking about my own uh, experience of Easter. I grew up um, and I went to a Catholic school from first through eighth grade. And during the season of Lent, which is from Ash Wednesday until Easter Sunday, we went to the Stations of the Cross every Friday afternoon. And um, this was a church service where um, they, they had, uh, it was Jesus's journey to Calvary, basically, a service in honor of that. So in our church, they had the, li the little plaques all along the wall where the sta each station. 
And we followed along in these little books, these little prayer books. There's a picture of the station and then a little prayer, and every time you turn the page, you say a new prayer. But these pictures were like Renaissance paintings. And it's like, you know, you're, you're pretty young, 10, 11 years old. You see these pictures that are so graphic and beautiful, and, but, you know, the crown of thorns with the blood dripping down, and it was uh, very detailed. Mary wipes the face of Jesus, and, and then they show the face of Jesus on a cloth in the pictures. And I was thinking, why would anyone do that to anyone? Why, it was just frightening to me. And um, so not only that, the priest at each station had the big urn of incense, and he'd be you know, doing this with the incense. You know, and we're not talking patchouli or cannabis here. It was just, you know, not very pleasant. And also, it was heavy. Yeah, heavy. And also, I sang in the junior choir so that when, during the Holy Week, we had to go to all the services and sing with the senior choir. And we'd be singing these songs like, Were You There When They Crucified My Lord? And all these songs in minor, and you know, Good Friday service was three hours long, and by Easter Sunday it was like we were resurrected ourselves. I was like, thank God, colors, all the flowers on the altar. They took oh, they used to have the purple cloth all through the season of Lent on the statue, so. That came off, so you could see the statues again, and everybody was wearing beautiful clothes, and ah, oh, that's sort of like what it really is Easter is about, is the rebirth and the regeneration um, of uh, life, and spring is like that as well. So this was a composition I made um, in honor of the ritual of Easter. So this is called Easter Morn. skirt gathered with a yellow ribbon silk white daisy on a floppy hat lacy white socks inside new shiny black shoes clickety clacking along the driveway stones Horn Puppies in the side yard garden, apple blossoms blooming on the backyard tree, lilies on the table in a crystal vase. Easter morning to me. Funny. Easter Bonnie hid my basket every year inside the dryer. Purple grass, marshmallow bunnies, and purple jelly beans. When I thought he knew my favorite were the orange ones. Wooden wicker basket on the buffet. Filled with eggs we dipped the day before Each one had a name No two were the same Extra ones for the kids next door It's taken me a long, long time Fit the pieces all together in my mind. How the ribbons and the incense burning helped me learn what Easter time really Dying, crying 
lion, a young man denying his favorite friend in the whole wide world. Lord, by your cross and resurrection, you've redeemed us. Didn't mean much to me, a ten-year-old girl. Cause I felt the same sadness, the same sweltering heat of the wooden cross on my shoulder bones as I sang Oh, sacred head surrounded by a crown of piercing thorns and I wished I had some purple heather or a pretty colored feather for his tablecloth, platter full of eggs and ham, toast and jam and sausage after church. Everybody laughing, singing Easter songs. Here comes Peter hopping right Thank you. Now, our CD, Always Love, would be a nice thing for an Easter basket, wouldn't it? You know? The teenagers might like it. Well, don't forget about um, cafelina.org down in your screen, slash tips. Feel free to um, leave some tips. You know how to bake an apple pie? <laughs> how to cook eggplant to get it to be really soft so it's mushy and yummy? No, really, that's just a joke. Okay, <laughs> like you didn't know. Um, okay. Oh, we're having a great time and uh, appreciate everyone being here and tuning in. And uh, a couple of us have been here before, a couple of us haven't. Oh, maybe there's some less people in that up here. Two, two haven't. Yes, no, I've two been here. I've hasn't. been here, Perry. Yes, we all have been. Right? I haven't been here at this here new. Today. This is beautiful, <laughs> by sure the is. way. For people who haven't been to Cafe Lena since they've um, changed it and um, renovated it, it's absolutely beautiful. And you should come and support it as much as possible. And. Um, Yes, I was here years ago with uh, a, a contingent from Rochester. Yeah. Uh, late, uh, Flower City Folk. Wow. It was very fun. First time and, I was and, here, I saw Wake Frankfield, a gentleman by name. Wow. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> now that we got that on, this is something completely different again. When nothing seems to go your way You just got trouble day to day And your heart just turned to black and blue You're running out of money And your lover's up and gone away You just don't know what to do Call on me
decide to go straight or to turn Wheels are spinning way too fast You just can't let go of the past You're wondering what it is you're supposed to learn Call on me Cause I've been there before I know just what it's like To hear the slamming of the door Call on me I'll be there in a moment's time Helping you times you rescued me blinded by misfortune I could barely breathe your love kept my deepest fears at bay and now the tide has turned I'll show you the Get out his little uh, Fender guitar that shrunk in the washing machine. Oh, that's what I meant. It shrunk in the dryer. It's actually an electric mandolin. <laughs> so this is a little. Um, this next song is a little um, kind of reggae-flavored song um, that I wrote in the car when I was driving in the car across Texas with someone who wasn't talking to me. For the entire, well, from Austin to El Paso, which is still quite a ways.
giving silence your protection silence nothing is growing barren searching questioning everything where you wanna be open your heart i say talk to me talk to me We so appreciate being here at Cafe Lena. It's just um, really, really just thank you so much for having us. And thank you to Sarah Craig. Um, she's out there somewhere, I hope. And uh, thank you, Sarah, and uh, everybody else helping, Reese and Joe and Joel. And uh, I think this is the right song. Don't look back. Let's see, let's see, not too fast, not too slow. Uh, okay, A one, two, three, four. <laughs>
long inside the sun Way up high above the clouds A voice saying What's done is done Don't look back All of that is over Keep on moving forward Don't look back Don't look back It won't change Keep on moving forward. Um, well, we have like two more songs we'd like to sing for you, and uh, thank you so much again for uh, the little tiny audience we have, which is very, uh, very fun. And uh, this is a song um, that I wrote for a good friend of mine, and we wanted to sing it um, because it's a full moon tomorrow night, and you might be able to see almost a full moon tonight. And what? It is tonight? It's tonight. I stand corrected. It's tonight, and we're singing this song to celebrate that beautiful spring new moon. And... Um, uh, this is for my good friend Tim, who passed away on the first day of spring. Let's see. You sent the moon, didn't you? A fiery wheel rising in the hill. Burning red, orange into golden, warming the November chill. Once love blazed fierce between us, now is growing cold. Our hearts are heavy as stone. You. Sunset, Jupiter and Venus side by side. And we were busting at the seams, chasing all our dreams, abandoning all that we own. You sent the stars, didn't you? To light Flying north, the 
Trio, Maria Gillard, Perry Cleveland, and Doug Henry. And uh, we're from the Finger Lakes, and we're ha happy to be in Saratoga County and Saratoga, New York. It's really awesome. And um, keep supporting Cafe Lena. Don't forget, cafelena.org slash tips. And always love. It's a great... Oh, it came right out of the package. We did, we They're went, flying off the shelves. They <laughs> We went the, you know, we went the eco route and didn't have the plastic on it, so this is the fallout of that. But um, it's a great album for uh, when you're cooking dinner. You know, it really is. And by the way, um, we did this live in a studio in Ithaca um, called Electric Wilburland, and um, we had the great uh, engineer Will Russell who is just a fantastic engineer and a fast, fantastic live uh, sound person um, for the Grass Roots Festival and all things all around Ithaca. So anyway, we were so appreciative of spending time with him and doing this. So anyway, there it is, mariagillard.com. And uh, let me leave you with this song. This, I'll tell you just a quick story about this. Um, I had this... Uh, friend who I was giving her daughter voice lessons and she um, and her and she came into my house to pick up her daughter and she goes okay I've got a contest for all you Rochester songwriters because I am so sick of hearing about your pathetic love lives I want you to write a song about me because all I do is drive my kids around and listen to the radio and it's my whole life. And so I don't want to hear about yours. I want you to write about me. And I'm um, having a contest. So whoever wins will get a prize. So get to it, you know, because her husband was also one of these songwriters. And uh, so this was my song that I wrote. Okay. Used to be a homemaker, bake cookies every afternoon. Sit around and read the paper From September until June Summertime came along It was chalk on the sidewalk And mow the lawn Fill up the kiddie pool No more school But now my kiddies are six feet tall They got swimming, soccer, basketball Lessons in viola, piano, and jazz And they want to go to the mall For some razzmatazz So I drop them off and pick them up I drop them off and pick them up I drop them off and pick them up But in between I'm the queen of the highway Yeah, rolling down 490 I got the windows rolled down and the radio loud Trying to get some release And I sing in my midnight confession When I'm telling the world that I love you I love you I 
night at a party on Sunday For my husband's friends, the songwriters Seems the cooking and the cleaning Ain't gonna end I gotta go to the grocery and the bakery The drugstore, the cleaner Be back by three to take Johnny to the diner Where he works the supper shift Katie to the barber She wants another hair lift But so I drop them off And pick them up I drop them off And pick them up I drop them off And pick them up But in between I'm the queen of the highway Yeah, rolling down 390 south I got the windows rolled down And the radio loud And air microphone in my mouth And you know I'm going when the sun keeps shining Through the pouring rain Going when the weather suits my See my picture on the cover I wanna buy five copies for my mother Yeah, I wanna see my smiling face On the cover of the Rolling Stone On the cover of the Rolling Stone On the cover of the Rolling Stone Well, I'll just be there smiling, man When I drop them off Thank you so much. Y'all come back now.